What's going on there, fellow YouTubers? Chris back with you with another cool little video. It's not going to be very long. I'm going to make this short, but I need your help on this one. This one here is cool. It's, it's one of those photos where you believe you see something, but it may not be what you think it is. So we're going to have a look at that right now. This is, this is I believe, is from Saul 1659, which I believe was on the 7th of April. Um, so we're going to have a good look at this because this is really, really cool. And when I started to look at this, I found an object in this photo, and then, wow, it just took off from there. Just like, whoa, this is just bizarre. I have said in the past that um, I believe the original photos are there. They are actually there, but they have an overlay uh, of their own objects, if you will, that they're putting in to hide what's really there. Or it's the way they put these photos together that really messes your eyes, and this is a perfect example of it. And, uh, guys, I'm going to do some speculating here, so don't take me like, oh, well, let's see, he's, it's etched in stone what he said. No. I just want you to get, I want your points and your, your views on this because this is just, this is crazy. I'm going to show you that right now. Okay, so we're going to be looking at these photos here, and you can see, I'm going to, it's about halfway down the page. And, of course, I zoomed this in a little bit so you can see it's, it is NASA and JPL. Um, and this is 1659. You can see that. Okay, so we're going to go down here, right about to here. I don't went too far down, but let's just check. Let's just see what happens. Yep, went too far down. All right, so we've got it should be right about in this area, which it is, and we're looking at the nav cam, and it's right, right nav cam. It's usually the clearer one, you know, because we do have a, uh, you know, different size cameras. Um, the right always seems to be better. Um, and, of course, we've got right here, you can see the time and date stamp. It's got right here. It's um, uh, April 4th, 2017, and, of course, I'm doing this on the 10th. Um, so pretty cool stuff here, guys. Anyway, let's have a look at the photo in question, which is right here. Now, this is a cool picture because, I mean, it's just neat. I mean, you can see what looks like a what looks like a butte on this side, and over here what looks like some kind of small hill mound, if you will. Um, but it isn't what you think it is. And after I seen this, because I always see the stuff that they're hiding in these photos, or like I like I one I did one it was like um, what looked like those. Uh, Trap doors, like a, something like that on a, what looked like on a, it could have been a ship or whatever. It looked like just trap doors. And everybody's like, how do you see an invisible door? Well, it's not so much the invisible door, it's the outlines to it. And that's what gives it away. So I don't mean literally invisible, um, meaning you can't see it at all. I'm saying outlines and things that give stuff away. Okay, so let's have a look in here. This is, this is what I found, which was pretty wild. Now, somebody had mentioned this to me uh, to have a look at this. So I apologize. I don't remember who it was off the top of my head because... Um, I do I have quite a you guys uh, uh, tell me, hey, Chris, have a look at this photo, have a look at this video, whatever. Um, so my apologies. You can always basically do it like a wave your hand thing. It was me, by the way. And I'll probably remember you right off the bat. Uh, so my apologies for that. But I was referred to this this photo. Um, but what I found it was crazy. Uh, one thing they pointed out, there's actually two things. I see this right here in the back, and we're going to get into that a little bit in, in a little bit. And this what looks like this cylindrical, almost like a bottle you know, like you put, you know, drinks in type thing. Kind of has that weird cylindrical thing type thing. And it looks like it kind of goes over to here too. But that's not what blew my mind. What had me thinking and it really had me going, whoa, this is neat. Is because I'm looking at this butte and I'm looking at this right here. Is it possible that this is not a butte at all? And it's just the opposite. We're looking into something. Mind blown yet? Watch this. Um, <laughs> this is just neat. All right. So... I'm going to get into this photo, and hopefully I don't go into it too much, but I'm going to show you these objects first. These are pretty cool. Um, the one in, right here, you can see that it looks like this weird cylindrical object. Um, let me see. Uh, yeah, right here. And you can see where it looks like it's kind of cylindrical, has that weird narrowness right here at the end, and then has this other piece. Now, I don't know if this thing has broken in half, and that's what we're seeing. I don't know. Um, this piece here, when you come back, you can see what looks like this Right here, the shape goes up, over, and it looks like it goes up and over like this here. See it? And whatever the heck that is on there. This could be an object which just could be anything laying over. It could be grass. could be anything laying all over this thing. Or it's just the way they're, you know, manipulating and taking this stuff out. Now, let's back out of this for a second because I want to show you. This is neat. What tipped me off to this thing is this. Why does this over here, and I'm going to just go like this. We're just going to head, go do this. Let's go into... Uh, uh, it doesn't really matter. We can go RGB or CMYK. Um, it isn't going to really matter, but we can do this too. Let's do this. Um, okay. 
Well, yeah, we're better off doing it this way. Um, we're going. Yeah, we're going to the CMYK. Why not? Just to show you guys real quickly uh, what's going on with this thing. Um, I thought this is really cool. Um, let me see if they got here. Oh, nope. I do. Let's go all the way red. I don't know if that's going to do it. Yes, it will. All right, check this out, guys. Now, I'm going to do this probably sloppily because let me see if I can, can't hold this mouse pad a little still. Do you see what looks like a panel right here? This whole area right here. I'm looking at that. I'm going, whoa, what is, is this the end of the, Bru the butte right here? And this is the whole butte. Or, or, get this, or is this the, en this, is this the end of something right here? If you look really carefully, you can see what looks like something doing this. Check it out, 90 degree angles, in and over, okay? This part continues to go up and up and over. It also looks like it continues a little bit further and does the same. I'm going, what the hell is that? Check this out. And it looks like it has a dot. Now I'm going to back back out of this. Well, at least take these lines back off. We'll do, yeah. Uh, we'll do this. Now check it out. Can you see that? I'm going to get in real close for anybody who's got the smaller devices. You can see that right there. See it? It has, you can actually see it come down, over, up, 90 degree angle, this and that. So is this an actual butte or is it the other way around? Check this out. I think you'll like this. Let's do this. Now I want to show you something that's pretty cool. This thing literally goes on, on and on, and you can see the lines. I'll show you this in a second. So. Is this an actual butte, or is what we're seeing, this almost reminds me, this whole thing almost reminds me of a glass wall or a dome. Now, you might go, oh, man, he's flipped his lid, or have I? When you look at this photo, is this, is this actually broken apart, and we're actually seeing inside this? Now, I'm going to go back to this. Now, I'm going to go to these different snapshots I've taken of the different steps I've taken. Um, of different parts of this. Now, I've, I've circled this right here. You can actually see this. Well, not circled it, but I actually lightened it up a little bit with the dodge tool, and you can see this right here. See it? So I was trying to blast through it because you can see this white line still goes through this. Okay? And, of course, you got this bottle-looking thing, but let's, let's keep going. Now, I did this to see if I can lighten it up and find anything else in here, but that wasn't the case. And I said, okay, let me just try it this way. So I'm trying my best to actually see through this photo. Okay, and you can see now this area doesn't have to worry. We don't have to worry about what color this uh, this is. But check this out. Now, watch this. So now I've lightened this up. Now I'm going to go back and forth so you guys can see this a little better. Okay, this is the original here. This is the one where I brought this up so you can actually see this a little better. Now I'm going to jockey back and forth on this thing so you guys can have a look. It's there. It's in the photo. There's no doubt about it. it's in the photo. Now, what I find really bizarre is the way this thing does this, comes over to here, goes up 90 degrees. Well, of course, we got this other piece in the bottom, so I, my bad on that. But you get the idea. It's like, what the hell is going on here? But this is all fudge as well. I believe this goes down further. And what we're seeing inside here is actual the inside of whatever this is. Does that blow your mind or not? Because as far as I'm concerned, at first I thought this is nothing more than a mountain. But it turns out to be the opposite. The darker area we're seeing here may be all underneath a broken open actual glass wall or dome. And this is what we're seeing. We're seeing underneath it. So now let me go keep going here. We can see what we've done here. Uh, now I'm going to outline it here so you guys can see it. Because there's other things I wanted you guys to see, too, because this was cool. If you look closely, you can see what looks like there's little white pieces in here. There's right here. See this line? Literally going like this. There's another one going like this. And then you can see this piece going down. This is perfectly straight across. Nice 90-degree angle. And I mean crisp 90-degree angle. Watch this. Let's go back. See that? Nice, crisp 90-degree angle. But there's more to this that meets the eye. So what you do is you take the dodge tool and try to get, do what you can to bring out any white that may be under here. Now, let's go into this a little bit more. Now, what happened is this is, gets even crazier because 
If you notice, and I'm going to go back to the original so we can be fair about this. I don't want to jump the gun. Check this out. You may not see nothing. You go, ah, I don't see anything else but this mound. Look carefully. You can see what looks like these lines. Like there's something else more into this photo. You can see what looks like these weird like pixelations. And you can see these little pieces like right here, here. And now I'm going to show you this in a minute because this is cool. Now let's back out. Now I started doing this and notice, here's another thing to notice. These things literally, you can see like a line of something going like this. And it goes right down past into this darker area. Why would this darker area be translucent or transparent in any way, shape, or form? Shouldn't be, right? You shouldn't see like an object that's way in the background going into the foreground or at least closer uh, ground. Uh, why would that do that? So after I started doing this to try to see if it could bring out any kind of shapes or anything in this area, watch this. The computer's running as slow as usual. That's okay. I should learn to take these other things that I got in this computer tasking on. Uh, go ahead and just put them on standby or shut them off. But you can see what looks like there's lines all up in here. And you can just see that. So I'm thinking, okay, well, you can see it looks, it looks like shadows of things here, 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 all inside. Now, I don't really care as much if that's anything or not. I, I really don't care. That's not my main issue. Um, but what you can see is this thing literally goes up. You can see like there's something right there where this goes up here. I'm going to do this outline again. See, it goes up and reaches up over to here, but it actually continues to do this too. You know what I mean? Um, watch this. You can see how it still goes up, but there's something, there's more. Whatever's in this right here, it actually goes through the back. So wait a minute, hold on. What the hell? This is what I'm getting at. I don't believe we're seeing a hill here. I believe we're seeing an opening of breakage in some kind of glass dome or wall. I don't know. And of course, again, it's all speculation. Now I'm going to just go back here. And what I try to do is bring up the light a little bit, the whiter pieces, if you will, underneath. See it? You can just start to see something faint right here. And you can see very, very slight right there. It's, it's nice. It's actually crisp here. If you look right here, it's nice and crisp right there. Goes down. And then you can see other little lighter areas right there, like outlined right there. And all of these pieces. Now, this is what I did to try to get rid of some of the color and then bring out some of the white and check this out. I believe, and I could be off base here. I'm not perfect here, guys. This here is actually an opening. I don't know if it was designed like that, but here's the thing. All of this ground here has been manipulated. So you don't know whether this goes down further or what. I don't know. Um, but have a look at that. I'm going to back out and look at the overall. It looks more like an opening to me. Am I wrong on this? Tell me. Give me. Hey, guys, just listen. Tell me honestly what you think it is. Do you think this is a mountain? As, as it, when you first look at it, it looks like a mountain. It really, truly does. Check this out. Here's the original. But I, again, I looked at this thing and I'm going, okay, that's, that's, a, that's a, uh, a, you know, some kind of maybe, well, even if it was a butte, it looks like a butte over this side and it looks like a, like a little mound or something right here on this side. And I'm looking at it and I'm going, what the hell? Why does that have this nice crisp cut here? And all of this is white. All of this is around it, it's white. And then you get this, these pieces here that are back and forth, they're up and down, it looks like something's broken apart or broken away from this, and you can see underneath it. In other words, it's not a mound. It's actually something under these, it's actually structures inside this, behind this white, uh, this glass wall. I'm going to say white because it looks white. Um, I don't know. You guys give me your take on it. There's the original, and this is fully, uh, you know, enhanced. And you can see, like I said, you, if you look carefully, you can see what looks like this structures or at least I'm going to say shadows because there's no way I can't say structures because that's kind of misleading but it looks like there's lines of things and they clearly go from here and they go down to this darker area now what is that and like I said that's not my main concern but it would make sense if there's something behind this let's say, let's say a hypothetical it was an actual glass dome or uh, maybe it's got like kind of like a weird frost type thing but you can see shadows behind it now, I'm not saying that's what it is again speculation but what the hell is that guys clearly that is not, or at least to me it is, in my humble opinion. I don't believe that's a, that's a mountain. I think, it's, I think we're seeing the actual reverse of a mountain. It's an actual entranceway or something that's been broken apart. This wall here, this glass wall or whatever it is, and we're seeing underneath it and then through underneath it. Uh, give me your take on it, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think it's, um, do you think it's, no, it's, it's just simply just a, a butte and that's it? 
Um, I mean, again, I'm going to just zoom in on the non-enhanced one and check that out. You can see, like I said, perfect 90-degree angle. Boom, comes down. And if you look really carefully, you can see this doing this. Very, very faint, but it's there. And then you've got this other one doing this. This one doing this. I actually went a little further than that, a little wider than that. My bad on that. I mean, this is just like like they literally put an overlay of these photos, and it blocks out what's truly there. Now, again, the eye can be fooled, and this is a perfect example of that being happening. Um, like I said, I don't see this as a I, – I actually see this as a wall now, and this is actually an opening. Look at the way it looks like it's actually broken away, and it has this nice nice pieces right here. Look at the way that is. Look at You can actually see it in the back. This back edge comes down over to here, up, over, and, and then it just does this. So I don't know, guys. Give me your take on it. What do you think is going on here? You guys will get the link. You know that. And here it is here, just so you guys know. Oh, one other thing I want to show you, because I want to. This is this is in comparison. Okay, here is a butte, and I use that term loosely because I don't think any of these are buttes. I think they're actual structures. Um, and you can see, like it's been fudged over here. It's like you can just see this. And let's say it's not. Let's just say it's not. Here's a butte. Looks pretty much, you know, uh, straight and cut. And look at this on this. And here's this actual. Um, here's the actual piece right here. That we're looking at, the one on the right. See that? Now I can't slide it over. I'm already over to the right as far as I can go, and you can see that. Um, and that's pretty crazy right there alone, right? So let me just shut that phone off. The thing started ringing on me. Um, but you've got these this piece right here. This is what we're looking at, and it looks like there's something missing here, like almost like part of a glass wall, if you will. And this is the one right here, right there. Anyway, guys, give me your take on it. Let me know what you guys think it is. Um, is it just me? Is it, it, you know, again, the eye can be fooled. We're looking at, is it a, um, is it a, is it actual opening and you're seeing in or is it an actual butte? Again, they fool with the eyes, but they made a mistake on this one, guys. They made a mistake. It looks like that weird panel, if you will. And that's what gave it all away. And I went, whoa, maybe I'm looking at something totally different here. I'm not looking at a butte, an actual object on the surface but an actual something huge and that you're seeing underneath what looks like a broken out glass wall, maybe a dome type thing. What do you guys think? Give me your take on it. Let me know what you think there. Anyway, leave a comment down below. Share the video, guys. You know it's always appreciated. Give me a thumbs up. Again, always appreciate it. And uh, we'll definitely see you in the next uh, video. Got some cool ones coming up. More moon, more Mars. Um, in fact, we got some uh, other cool stuff coming up you're going to really like. So anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Always appreciate it. I will see you in the next video.